insert a flex liner bag into the cup support. Fill the flex liner bag with material and screw the cup cover onto the cup support. Tighten until the two alignment guides are within range. Align the vacuum valve on the cup cover with the prime pump spray knob pointed in the prime pump position. Push the cup assembly onto the sprayer and twist to lock. The vacuum valve is an important part of your new sprayer. It's used to evacuate the air out of the flex liner. Open the vacuum valve cap. Gently squeeze the flex liner bag to push the air through the vacuum valve just until you see material enter the vacuum valve reservoir. Stop squeezing the flex liner bag and snap the vacuum valve cap closed. You will hear the cap click when it's properly closed. For maximum air evacuation, slightly tilt the sprayer so the vacuum valve is at the highest point. Plug the sprayer into a power source. Turn the prime pump spray knob down to the prime pump position. Point the sprayer into a bucket and pull the trigger for five seconds. Depending on your model, set the dual speed switch to high or the variable speed control to 10. Air from the pump may have entered the flex liner during priming. Repeat the previous air evacuation steps to ensure you have an airtight system. Turn the prime pump spray knob forward to the spray position. Make certain the spray tip is fully installed and locked into the spray guard and pointed in the spray position. You are now ready to spray.